Hello YouTube, my name is Dave Mock and today I want to talk about my top 6 Battlefield replacements that you can play basically today if you have the money and the time. So let's begin. Number 6 is Red Orchestra 2 and Red Orchestra 2 Rising Storm. These games are made by Tripwire Interactive and is a realistic first person shooting game with features like crew managed tanks and vehicles, authentic weapons and hardcore PvP and PvE combat. So if you purchase both of these games, then you will have the Eastern and Pacific Front, meaning Japan, America, Russia and Germany as factions in the game. This is a more realistic take on what Battlefield 5 should have been. Number 5 is a World War 2 mod for Arma 3 and Arma 2. Arma is a fan size made by Bohemian Interactive and is a realistic battle simulation. But to bring you back to the mods, Arma 3 does have a lot of mods in all sizes and diversity. But one of the big mods I am talking about does have a light version of World War 2 and a full version that utilizes and requires a second game that is called Iron Front. But there is alternatives to this mod. Arma 2 mod is called Invasion 44 and is also based upon the idea of World War II Warfare. These games and mods are open world based and includes map editor with different maps and you can play and utilize other mods within your World War II mod. This makes a modern warfare against World War II type fantasy war. And that is not to mention the other fan-made missions and add-ons that works with Steam Workshop integration. A truly fantastic concept of a game and a realistic simulation of war with the added community building in mind. And all these mods will be linked in the description. Number 4 is Battlefield 1942 and Battlefield 1943. Now Battlefield 1942 is the first entry in the Battlefield franchise and deserves its title in spades. This game over the years have been played and modded even to this day and it's with great reason. On top of that Battlefield 1942 adds two other expansions and that is not to mention the great modding community that emerged from this game. To name a few mods is doing it injustice. But if you are interested, check out Battlegroup 42, Forgotten Hope and Modern Warfare and all these will be linked in the description. Battlefield 1943 is a console exclusive unfortunately. But it is a great and small successor to the old Battlefield 1942's formula and it adds a bit more destruction but lacks more maps than the original series but still a great game and a potential replacement to Battlefield 5. Number 3 is a mod called Forgotten Hope 2 for Battlefield 2. This mod deserves to be a standalone game. This unbelievable realistic World War II game with attention to detail and amazing work truly shows how much work they have put into this mod and it is pretty fun to say the least. Oh and if you are interested in buying Battlefield 2 on Origin, well you can't because they don't care about their fan base, young and old, truly impressive. Number 2 is a great game called Ravenfield. This awesome indie game defines all the great reasons why Battlefield 1942 was a, such a success and I highly encourage you to check out their game. If you think Ravenfield, you can see the glorious future for indie games that takes on the AAA market with their own unique genres and listening to their fans and implementing their ideas to make a wonderful and well thought of game and discarding scummy AAA games that does not care about their fan base and only cares about money.
Number one is a game that is what we all love and need in a Battlefield title. Post scriptum, the bloody seventh, brings large scale battles, 50 vs 50 online matches, detailed vehicles of World War II, base building, and the icing on the cake is modding. I truly hope for the best on these developers, not just on this game, but in all these mods and games that, that I've mentioned. This is what gaming community must be all about. So that is the end of my list. Do you agree or disagree? Please let me know in the comments down below. And for more content like this, subscribe to my channel. My name is Devmo, thank you for watching, signing out.